okay. I think... I'm thinking maybe the moves for today are finally over. Um, you know, constantly expecting every five minutes there to be some new move, but... Okay, I think the first day... This isn't the first day for you to see if it's the, it's the legal tampering period. So... So it's kind of the first day of free agency. It's over. There's some Viking stuff to uh, talk about. Um, so two guys we signed. We signed Josh Oliver, not John Oliver. I keep wanting to call him John Oliver. Josh Oliver, uh, tight end, who was with uh, the Ravens. I guess he's a, a real elite blocker. Um, signed him for to a deal that I guess is not actually that expensive. It was announced as like three years, 21 million, but it's not even close to that. You always got to wait and find out what the particulars of the contract are because you hear everyone's freaking out this afternoon like, three, we're giving a three-year, $21 million deal to a blocking tight end. Well, we're not. That's just not what the deal is. It's actually a pretty low deal. Um, so, I mean, Irv Smith's out the door. He's not coming back. So we got this guy, you know, obviously Hawkinson's going to get most of the tight end, uh, tight end catches. Um, so I think that's, that's, you know, it's a solid deal because it's not, it's not anything big. I'm not going to pretend like I know who these guys are. That was <laughs> like, it just, you know, it's what you read, what you read about them. Um, and then, uh, tonight we signed, uh, uh, Marcus Davenport, uh, edge rusher. He was with the Saints last year. Um, one year, thirteen million. We'll see what that actually comes out to in, in the deal. Um, it, he's he's basically be, basically going to be the new Zadarius Smith because Zadarius Smith is probably out of here. So we bring in another guy who can rush the passer, but has some injury history. Um, and you know everybody's freaking out like, oh, he only got I think he only got like one sack last year or something like that. You know, that doesn't necessarily mean that or anything. Supposedly he's actually one of the better edge guys uh, on the market. And I'm going to say it a million times between now and the draft and beyond. If Brian Flores wants this guy, you know, which I'm sure he's he's got a lot of input, if Flores wants him, then that then that's a good deal. Um and we're still we're still like above the cap. We don't have to get up under the cap. Uh, until Wednesday, which is the first official day of free agency. Uh, they restructured Jordan Hicks for a pay cut, so he's going to be sticking around. And again, if Flores wants to keep him, then then keep him. Um, and, uh, yeah, so that's it for the Vi actual Vikings moves. Um, we And we did lose some guys. We, uh, I mean, we already... Had released Eric Kendricks. He signed with the Chargers, uh, and then uh, Patrick Peterson went to Pittsburgh. And, you know, there was a lot of talk that maybe he would still come back here, but you know, he got a pretty good deal from Pittsburgh and took that. Uh, Dalvin Tomlinson took a pretty big deal from the Browns. You know, the deal. You know, numbers I saw on that. I have no problem with the Vikings not matching that. I mean. Not that Tomlinson was bad, but he also wasn't great, and you know, I, th I think that's okay to get to let him go. And then um, uh, Cameron Dantzler was picked up off waivers by Washington, um, so he's out, of course. Um, so, you know, so we definitely, uh, you know, there are more there are more going out than coming in. People are free. The Vikings fans are freaking out. This this so annoying. It's every year we got to deal with this shit. The, these people act like the roster has to be set on you know what was it March thirteenth. It doesn't. This is just day one of many to come. Um, because people are freaking out like, oh, we don't have any cornerbacks. Like we're not gonna sign anybody. Like we're not gonna draft anybody. We're gonna have we're gonna have cornerbacks. Hopefully they're good cornerbacks. But we're gonna have guys. Um. Um, but uh, you know, I don't like the Davenport deal it's one year 13 million you're not making a signing like that if you're planning to tank the tank Nazis really want this to be the they really want the Vikings to just blow it all up 
and just forfeit the season, maybe forfeit a few seasons and, and collect draft picks and be bad because that's how you get to be good. I like what's I like what they did so far. You know, it's not major moves. I mean, you know, they ha they haven't gotten rid of anybody who I was like, oh my god, we got to keep this guy. And you know, a couple nice signs where there's going to be more. There's obviously you know they still have moves to make to get under the cap. There's still a lot of talk about a Dalvin Cook trade. There's you know still potential something could happen with Kirk. Um, there's guys who could be cut. Um, Names obviously are out there. Harrison Smith is a possibility. C.J. Ham maybe. Obviously, this is Darius Smith. They're going to do something. Um, but uh, and there's also the not official, but it sounds like uh, Aaron Rodgers to the Jets maybe isn't isn't official yet, but it's really really close to being official. It hasn't been announced. That would have to be a trade, of course, not a free agency thing, but. Uh, we're close to, to not having to see this fucking asshole in the NFC North anymore. Um, but uh, yeah, so that's 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 the day's uh, news, which everybody knows. No one's no one's watching this to find out what happened. But uh, um, you know, I think it's a you know a solid start to the to this uh, to this free agency run for the Vikings. We'll see what happens with a lot of these other moves, and, and you know, again, I don't know who I don't know who these guys are until I until I hear about it, until I see them signed them. Like, you know, it's very rare that uh, you know, you know, I, I'm not I'm not well versed in the 53 man rosters of every other NFL team, so I like I like the moves um, so far, and we'll see what uh, what future days uh, bring us.